Corey Hawkins, who pleaded guilty to first-degree murder in the slaying of Nellis Airman Nathan Payette, appeared for sentencing before Judge Douglas Herndon at the Regional Justice Center on Tuesday. Quite honestly, it was. I think insidious was the word I used last time when I was addressing uh, Ms. Payette at the time of sentencing, and, and that's really what it is. I mean, it was one of the most insidious plots to kill somebody that I had come across during, during my time as either an attorney or a judge. Going out and gunning this man down in his garage where his family and children were um, so that he stumbles in the door and dies in front of his children was just mind-blowing, to be quite honest. Um, I don't view it, however, as something that you just kind of were the, the last guy involved the night of or the day of kind of thing. I think it preceded that substantially. Um, and when you consider uh, evidence suggesting that you're a shooter, evidence suggesting you were involved in this for more than just a couple of days type thing, and looking at a very, very extensive and violent prior record and multiple <coughs> failed paroles and probations and, and uh, the fact that you had been on parole or been released on parole probably nine months before this offense was committed, yeah, I do agree without any question that life without the possibility of parole is an appropriate sentence. So, uh, as to Hawkins was sentenced to life without the possibility of parole for Payette's murder.